What's up, guys? Shallow Snow 1997 here. Welcome back to more Castlevania Aria of Sorrow. So, it's been a couple weeks since I actually recorded the last part, so I kind of don't remember what we last did, but I know exactly what we're gonna do for this part. We're gonna go underwater and explore some areas! Hooray! Alright, let's do this. So, we're gonna backtrack a bit here, re cut through the quarters of the castle corridor yes yes and this is the area that we are str we have been aiming for ow stupid merman stupid merman people all right so we're going to the under I think this place is the underground reservoir I don't know oh well we're just gonna go with it it's because we're gonna go underwater actually first off we can actually use the Udin soul to walk on water. Yes. Walk on water. Like we've been doing for a little while because Soma Cruz is the equivalent of Jesus. Somehow. Someplace. I don't know. Um, let's see. Where is the spot? Okay, here's a spot that we can go up to. It has a bunch of mermen, so. You could just kill them all off the bat with your uh, with a soul that you may have and blah blah blah. And here you can obtain the elfin robe. It's not that good at the moment. I don't know if it's good at all because I don't put on items that lower my defense and whatnot. So yeah, that's a big issue thingy here. Uh, yeah, I need the soul set, actually. Alright, now let's explore some more places. Here we got some needles. Oh yeah, there's gonna be this... Oh, this is not what I was thinking, but... Alright. At some point in this game, I'm going to be telling you that there's three souls that you absolutely must get. And there's little books to find them. And, uh certain territories throughout the castle. Ooh. I forgot this thing was here. If you go up here, you can obtain the... Rab Sword. It lowers my defense and my... Con, con, I guess it's conscience, I guess? I, I don't know, but... I don't know, I'm just gonna get through here. So, yeah. Three souls which are gonna be very important if we want the ultimate true ending. Oh, actually, heading further this way actually progresses the story, so that's cool. But first, I want to take an exploration trip up here. Ah, uh, too big. I'll worry about it later. Let's see, where can we go? Nowhere else but down. Here's a safe room if you want to go to that, but you know what, uh, we don't need that. So, uh, I'm recording all this on a, is there a cutscene here? Nope. But there is a giant worm. This looks like the place that you could keep an item in, but... Whatever. I have no idea what the use of the giant worm is. It's kind of... Sort of, really. I'm going the other way, because I think there's... M yes, there is. Did you see that? Because that's going to be important for later. I'm pretty sure it's going to be important for later, at least. So let's head up here. Or in here. We got an uni. Some giant worms. There's a ton of things here. Ah. Ha! Huh, that thing was called a nightmare, I think. You drop from the ceiling like a fool. I don't know. I'm kind of lost for words for what to talk about. Ow. Foul beast. Is there something in here? There's a big golem. If you want to fight this thing. It's probably a good idea because it's going to stand in your way. Oh, actually. Actually, no, it doesn't. I don't know, but I need to restore some health and some magic. Ow. 
And in here is another save room if you want to save and whatnot, but I don't want to save just yet. There's probably more to this area there to like explore and cover and whatnot, but I'm just I'm just too lazy to explore through it all. And like I said in a later or a earlier video, I am not looking to 100% this game and there's a random killer fish there. Strange placement, but there's a killer fish there. Huh. So I got the slime soul. And a level up. Looks promisable. I still have my uh skull soul on, I believe, right? Yes I do. What's up here? Water. Well, Water's water, really. Yeah. There's probably something up here that's gonna make me want to be up on high ground. It doesn't look like it. However, maybe if I follow this track, actually, this track's not gonna lead me anywhere. I'm just gonna explore because I know there's something. I think maybe. <laughs> I know there's something. I think maybe in here. I have been possessed by a blue demon thingy! And that's what you get for possessing me, foo. Huh. <sighs> so much castle. Hey, look, a door. Maybe this will lead me to a brand new territory. Wait a minute, what the frig? Castle corridor. I didn't realize that I for I totally forgot about this area. Oh my god. Huh. Well, we have a, another gateway to get through here now if we really want to come around here. So uh, let me equip my soul, my uh, Jesus soul, as I like to call it. Let's see. Which way did I come from? I'm probably gonna need the water to be it, like in the water, like under it to get through, but it's, it's probably sort of maybe not kind of the case, so I don't think I have much to worry about. Alright, I'm back from where I kind of started in this area, I think. Yep, that's it. Wait, Persephone, why do I have that set? Whatever, I'll just have it set. I don't care. There's a ton of needles here. Oh great, more giant area. All right, so these are fish heads. I think we've seen these already. And the thing that was behind it is a Triton. Not Titan, Triton. Speaking of Titans, has anyone who, anyone who watches or reads, well, not watching at the moment, like anybody who reads the Attack on Titan manga, did any of you re read the latest chapter that came out? Because I did, and, and it was oh, it was this oh, it was this area that I just made a whole fucking loop, huh? I do that a lot. Dead Crusader. Huh. <laughs> now you're dead. I think. What does this place lead me to? S stuff. Um. This is definitely square one. Gonna use this to heal. Cause healing is kinda needed right now. Get in here. Oh, this is just the room of the giant worm. There's a room somewhere in an area that looks like this. That'll progress our story. And I think I just have to go through there. Where is this area? We may never know. We know we're definitely going to know, but it's not going to be for a while. It, it's hard to believe that 
this is o we're only this is actually like 10 minutes of the video which is unfortunate <laughs> probably more time was waste probably due to the fact I was wandering around oh kill it it's dead oh jeez oh god oh as my science teacher would say holy Menendez Whatever that is. Oh, these dryad thingies are really bad. Annoying. And that's why they're annoying. They'll, like, sprout their seed upon the... Okay, if you want to continue further in this area, you're going to need a curly soul. Which I do not have at the moment, so we're going to come back to this spot. Because some very key items are over there. Oof. <sighs> By the way, that thing, that purple worm, that looked like the giant worm, is called a. It's, excuse me, it's a. Uh, I should just walk on water for this. Thank you. Damn it, Medusa. Awesome, a teleporter. If you want to teleport, which I'm going to do. I just, since I'm ending off the video, I just realized I'm ending off my videos all the time in this area, in the castle corridor. I, do, I don't know why, I guess it's only because it's probably the most closest area. Oh boy. <coughs> Bless me. Ah, It's the closest area. And that's connected to where I need to go. Anyway, that'll be all for this part. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more. Goodbye.